Welcome back to Writing First Grade Friends. Today we're going to learn to address and mail an envelope. What do we mean by addressing an envelope? When we address an envelope, we are learning to fill out the information it needs in order to be mailed out correctly. We're also going to learn how to mail this letter out. First, you need to know the recipient's address. This is a fancy word that describes who the letter is going to be for and where the letter needs to be sent to. And this information goes in the center of your envelope, right in the middle, friends. You need to know the person's name, their house and street number, the city, state, and zip code of where they live. This is called the recipient address. Without this, your friend or family member cannot get your letter, friend. Once you have the recipient address, you need to add the return address all the way in the left-hand corner. And this is your address if you're the person sending the letter. It has your name and the same information. Let's go over it one more time. It will have the sender's name, their house and street number, the city, state, and zip code. What else do we need to add on an envelope in order for it to get to our loved ones? In order to send a letter, it needs a stamp, of course. And real stamps have pictures of important people, places, or fun designs. So let's see. You have your address, which is the return address on the pink box. This is the left-hand corner, friends. And the recipient address goes right in the middle. This is who you're sending the letter to. And the right-hand corner, this is where your stamp goes. Once you have all these three parts on the front of your envelope, your envelope is ready to be mailed. Now, how do we mail a letter? Two options. One, you can walk to your nearest mailbox and drop it in. Or two, you can go to your nearest post office and drop off your letter. Today for your assignment, you have three choices. Make sure you choose one. Option A, I need to send a letter to my friend Angie and Angie lives all the way in another state. Help me address my envelope by copy and pasting or dragging the return address or my recipient address onto the front of the envelope. Don't forget the stamp. Where do these addresses and stamp go? Option B, if you can cut and paste today, friends, you can cut out and paste the labels onto the front of this envelope picture. As part of this assignment, you can color and add your own design to a stamp. Ask a grown-up if you can cut out today, and once you can do that, you can stick your stamp onto the front of this envelope. Option C says mail a real letter. If you have an envelope and stamp at home, you can mail a letter you've written to a real person so far. Have a grown-up help you write the person's address and the return address on the envelope. Put on a stamp and then walk to the nearest mailbox to mail your letter. Don't forget to send a video or picture of you mailing your letter, friends. This is part of your assignment. If you are a friend that's in Growing Up Green today, you might not be able to complete this option today, but that's okay. You can always choose option C another time. Have a great time choosing one of your assignment options, friends. Goodbye.